Christ sounds really uh, foreign to you, really odd. But maybe it's intriguing. Maybe there's something in what I said that you identify with and that you want. Maybe you want to be compassionate and kind and humble and gentle and patient. Maybe you want to be able to forgive anybody out of love, not because it makes you feel better. If that's you, I want to challenge you to make a step today to follow Christ. In the seat back in front of you, you'll find a decision card. If you would just fill that out and then turn it into either one of the prayer partners stationed around the sanctuary or drop it off in a bucket on your way out, we want to get in touch with you. And we want to talk to you about what it means to follow Jesus. The second group, maybe there are some of you in here and you haven't made Christ the center. Christ hasn't been all in all in some areas of your life. And as we pray in the next few minutes, I want you to think of what that is. Maybe it's unforgiveness. Maybe it's hurt. Maybe it's hatred. Whatever it is, I want you to think about it. I want you to ask Jesus if he would become the center in that area of your life. Let's pray. Jesus, we thank you for this day. We thank you for your living word moving among us. We thank you that there is forgiveness of sins in you. And I ask today that as we look at what is in your word and continue to reflect on it, that you would help us make you the center. In the name of Jesus, amen. What's that? Did I go over like a hundred?